Today we will be performing the part two of our two-part series for the procedure of removing and installing the M351 M451 fuser maintenance kit part number uh, well it's a metro fuser part number M351-kit and the OEM fuser part number is RM18054 and for that we'll be using the M451DW device for our demo today and uh, we're going to be replacing the fuser at this point and for those who don't know the fuser just simply bonds toner to the paper with heat and pressure so we will begin by making sure the printer is off and unplug for at least 15 minutes and we'll approach the machine from the rear pull down the rear access door and we're going to remove the transfer roller first now, this part as well does not have a part number currently uh, set aside for the OEM so the industry seems to be using a M351-TR so that uh, seems to work well if you need it and next we'll be moving to the fusing assembly. Only tools needed for this job is uh, really a magnetic tipped Phillips head and tweezers. To install, just reverse the process. Reinstall the white plug on the right side and the left plug on the left top. And then the third plug on the top, center right. Refeed the wire guide through the wire guide. Keep them out of the way. A couple of repair notes on this. It does have a 125,000 page yield according to the OEM. And there is no page count reset for this fuser maintenance kit as the printer does not track page counts or any type of maintenance. And of course, Metrofuser has these in a number of different options, OEM and compatible. And it's complete. Thanks for watching. If you like, uh, please like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos and visit us online at metrofuser.com. Thanks.